once I was in America, after the wonderful performance, one journalist came to me and asked that I need to interview. I said, I am not interested. Then he went to my organizer and uh, persuaded him. He said, he is going to ask just three questions, so why don't you answer? I said, okay. Then he came to me and I said, shoot the first question. His first question was, from how many years you have been performing sand art? I said, I never performed sand art. The interview was over. Because on that day, sand was not available in California. So I performed with salt and art together. So it has to be called salt art. <laughs> so I said, okay, since you are so much uh, curious about my artwork, let me do pond art. <laughs> there, was, there was a little pond. And, uh, I would like to call Sand is just a medium to express yourself. Now, you use words to express. Somebody use gestures to express. Somebody use colors to express. I am using this medium. And I am not sand artist. I am far more than that. So when I received a call from organizers, they said the theme they have named Inside Out. Immediately, I reminded of Superman. That must be the big example. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought to myself, so I am not Superman. You know, I'm, I don't have any superhuman qualities. I am a stupid, dumb, ordinary citizen. Yes, of course. I am absolutely happy from my childhood. I have no curiosity to do something in my life. I have no curiosity to impress anybody. I am just curious to live moment to moment. Not to win the moment, to become the moment. So let's go a little deeper into the uh, performance and we'll talk. So whenever I perform, the first introductory drawing would be the same. And many people have asked me, my event managers, why you always draw the same picture again and you don't get bored? I said, uh, let's go and have a cup of tea. And that's the, that person say that, okay, let's go. And you don't get good of tea. <laughs> You're having again and again. Why? Why I draw this? Because my, till 20 seconds I was like that. I had no friends to say that he is my best friend. I have no day in, day out. I discovered when I used to come to school around, I used to play with the dog. Call me, are you crazy? Why are you playing like that? It will be released soon. Because I am done. I declared long back that I am, I am not going to share, which is inside. And see. And I have no interest or curious thing to compare with others. Because thank God we have only uh, 200 crore people in India. What? 1000 crores. What if, if, if we have too much advanced aliens lives are just adjacent to us? How much we compare and how much we achieve? What works really hard may become successful and earn. There was a moon. This man is not playing the music. <laughs> <laughs> and there was a sun also. Only half of it happens. <laughs> Are a scientific evolution, but here it is just easy. I can draw sun and moon. This is how I erase barriers between the sun and moon. Forget all about human beings. Any drawing. The verb. Okay. If, if coming for a lunatic asylum, I say, I will say that the moon was lunatic. Uh, the sun was a sail. If I perform for somebody else, I use the same drawings. Of course, drawings will be more uh, professional and. Uh, at least I'll try to draw one or two drawings next 10 minutes. I have 10 more minutes. She is Rudra Devi, okay? Because I 
don't have much time to uh, draw Rudrapadevi perfectly. Now just, in Indian tradition there is one thing called, they give trees came, trees gone. Just, okay? And Rudrapadevi might, might be uh, thanking my face. <laughs> a real man who is the general of Allahuddin Khilji. <laughs> Not Allahuddin Khilji. He is the general of Allahuddin Khilji. His name is Malik Kapoor. He invaded the Kakatiya kingdom. Okay? In invasion, what happens if it is 3D movie like this? All arrows will come. <laughs> and arrows destroyed the kingdom and sun and moon has no clue what is happening they came again <laughs> this time starts too and the strangest one is Anushka also came from the Arundhati then here I am going to come to the story because I am going to speak little more nonsense five more minutes. <laughs> the general of Allahuddin Khilji Kil escaped with Kohinoor diamond. Kohinoor diamond is going through the story and so we are not interested. Okay? Okay. Say it, I want to exit. it. So he might have drawn on a rock and with his thumbnail he might have drawn something in the sand that might be their first painting exhibition <laughs> which took place in the gallery of existence and then he might have thought this is ephemeral it's like tide it is gone then he might have discovered discovered the white chalk or charcoal so he might have used charcoal against the white wall he might have used charcoal against blackboard first. <laughs> Later on he might have described that, okay, we have to use contrast colors to depict something. There it might have began. Now I am just doing the same thing. Now you see a caveman in front of you, just imagine, and telling a story, expressing myself. And you have to understand that the art form, the this particular art form, the all credit goes to not the artist. Because people call it it's a medium of art. No, it's a medium of storytelling. If you see my canvases, you will be surprised. There is no relation between these strokes and that. Because I have enough time to express. I may take one month to finish a canvas. Here I want to I don't want to take time. For example, no one knows, even I don't know. I don't I never practice because I want to commit mistakes and the real meaning of creativity is committing mistakes consciously. So I commit mistakes as consciously as possible. So that I experience my own show. Now whether you experience it or not, whether you like my talk, my I my ears are enjoying. I could see that. I am enjoying this talk. So if I draw something, audience mind, I mean yours your mind will follow this stroke and I stop then already it has multiple images in his in the mind it's a hair then again I start drawing then thus that mind starts following my hand hence it becomes the only art form where we are all performing here I am not performing you are also psychologically performing hence I love this art when I paint I only paint and when the I don't know what it is. Okay. In 1920, one German lady did it, the first sand art. I have seen in Delhi that uh, a one and a half minute uh, recording was there. And the person who has that recording said that all credit goes to the light, the person who invented the light and the person who invented the camera. <laughs> Just remove this. Close your eyes and open, you see now. <laughs> Okay. So I 
did many many experiments as for us this particular so i just draw myself in the end and two minutes we are sing a song together okay sati papa nau lo unnadi re prati pratindi nive paadu kuntunnadi nive paravashi So I just bow down to the creativity in you. Please accept my bow down.